Hey, it's part two of Is Your Bike Ready? This is a 1997 Honda. It's kind of a mechanic special, right, yep. Logan? We would call this mechanic special. It needs a little TLC. <laughs> so Logan is our specialist here for part two of this series. Uh, we're gonna start with what? We're gonna start with lights. So clearly <laughs> what, this doesn't- What light, Logan? <laughs> so when you go check out your bike, make sure that your lights are all working, that your high beams work, uh, your low beams work, make sure your signal lights work on both the front and back, and also make sure your brake light works actually sit on the bike and gently press the brake like like you normally would right. and have someone behind you make sure that it works that's a great point okay while we're here we're actually right next to the fork seals so when you're looking at the lights and everything else take a look at your physical fork seals look at the seal itself make sure that it's clean so physically put your hand rub around the seal itself so it should nothing should be coming off nothing here. should okay. be it should be very 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 clean if you do feel that there is some oil there, I would absolutely take a look at it, make sure that it's working as intended, and I'd always recommend having it brought down to the shop. After you check this, make sure that your battery works, because the lights don't work if the battery doesn't work, and it doesn't start when the battery doesn't work. So when you're looking at your battery, physically take a look at your battery, make sure that the ends are clean, that there's a good solid connection. So when you mean clean, so it doesn't have any what, corrosion or? Correct, okay. absolutely. So corrosion, um, make sure that it has a charge on it. Is there a, a life span for a battery? Like will there be a manufacturer date on that? Well, or... it, it depends on the, the battery and the quality of the battery okay. and if you properly maintain your battery. So your battery wants to always have a small little charge on it. So I would definitely recommend picking up a trickle charger mm. and making sure that your battery lasts a long time. If you don't do that, then your battery won't last nearly as long as if you properly charge it uh, and keep it on a small charge at all times. Well, Logan, we appreciate this. Some advice to get back on the road and safely get back on the road. Yes. That's the key. And bottom line is, and I'm sure you would agree, if you're still not sure, go to one of the manufacturers. A lot of them have a service where they'll actually pick up your bike. True? Absolutely. And if you do that, then you feel a lot safer on the road. Thanks for your time, man. I appreciate this. Anytime. That's cool. Yeah,